symbolism. Introduction. This study session will introduce you to the use of symbols in prose literature. Symbols appear all around us. Anything can be given symbolic significance. Without symbols, our lives will be curiously uninventable. Awareness of the novelist's use of symbols is not all that different from the kinds of perceptions and interpretations that allow us to make sense of our daily lives. When you have studied this session, you should be able to define and use correctly the term symbolism. A symbol is a person, object, or event that suggests more than its literal meaning. It is the use of one thing to stand for another. That is, object, actions, ideas are given symbolic meanings when they are used to represent other ideas, actions, or objects other than themselves. This fundamental definition is explicit enough, but the use of symbol in prose fiction makes some students slightly jittery because we tend to regard it as a trap, a covert device that can go off during the seemingly harmless class discussion. This kind of attitude is naturally common. We know, for instance, that the ring that is used in a wedding is more than just a piece of jewelry because it suggests the unity and intimacy of a couple involved. The bride's gun may be white because it associates innocence and purity with that woman. Or, consider the meaning of the small alligator pepper and cola nuts among the evil ethnic group of Nigeria. The ring, the white gun, and alligator pepper are symbolic because each has meanings that go beyond its specific qualities and functions. Symbols such as these that are widely recognized by the society or culture are called conventional symbols. The Christian cross or a national flag, national flag have meanings understood by large groups of people. Certain kinds of experience also have traditional meanings in African cultures. The appearance of the moon, rain, symbolizes one thing or another. So also, black means death. Green evokes the image of youthfulness and regeneration, and so many more. A literary symbol includes traditional, conventional, or public meanings, but it may also be established internally by the total context of the work in which it appears. In Ikra Amas, the beautiful ones are not yet born. Ama does not use the bus conductor as a conventional symbol of transportation, movement, safety, and comfort from a poverty stricken society. Instead, the box at the beginning of the story is wicked and its parts being pulled together. Symbolically, this is Ghana. Ghana after years of mystery, everything about the box is unwholesome. A literary symbol can be a certain character, action, object, name, or anything in a work that maintains its literal significance while suggesting other names. Importantly, symbols cannot be limited to a single meaning. They are suggestive rather than definitive. They are evocation of varieties of meanings by the use of symbols allows the writer to say more with a few words. Symbols are economically devices for evoking complex ideas without having to result without having to result to painstaking explanations that would make a story more like an essay than and experience. For instance, 
the several sites of this in a mass of beautiful ones are not yet home cannot be reduced to one idea. They have multiple meanings that unify the story. When a character, object, or incident indicates a single fixed meaning, the writer is using is using allegory rather than symbol. Unlike symbols, which have literal functions as well as multiple meanings, the primary focus in the legal is on an abstract abstract idea called forth by the concrete object. Oftentimes, stories include symbols that you may or may not be seeing on a first reading. Subtle use of the sign of the writer's skill in weaving symbols into the fabric of the characters' lives. Symbols sometimes escape you, but that is probably better than detecting symbols with only literal meanings are intended to. Allow the text to help you verify if a symbolic reading is appropriate. Once you are clear about what literally happens, read carefully and notice the placement of details that are emphasized. The repeated references to Kola in page 107 of The Beautiful Ones Are Not Yet Born calls attention to themselves and Moran's symbolic readings. A symbol, however, needs not be repeated to have an important purpose in the story. By not losing focus on the total context of the story, you should be able to decide if your reading is reasonable and consistent with the other facts. Plenty of lemons in literature yield no symbolic meaning, even if they are squeezed. Be sensitive to the meanings that the author associates with people, places, objects, and actions. In this study session, we discuss the significance of symbolism as a device in prose literature. We stated that a symbol is a use of one thing to stand for another, that is, objects, actions, ideas, are given symbolic meanings when they are used to represent other ideas, actions, or objects other than themselves. We have now come to the end of study session four.